folks welcome to another video now this one i was going to can actually because i did it about two months ago it's only a short one about five minutes um, afterwards i kind of wasn't really that happy with it thanks trev um but i thought anyway better than deleting it i thought i'll put it out there on a tuesday um, instead of the normal friday slot um, but yeah let me see what you think um cue me in the nice sunshine hi everyone welcome back to another video lovely to have you along on another sunny afternoon here at chessfield now, if you're an out to winner, so a slicer, just check this out because I haven't seen anyone or a coach do this. Okay, so I haven't gone mad. I've got some tape here, which I'm gonna put on my arm. So I'm gonna put on the front of my elbow. Now, I don't expect you to do this. This is for demonstration purposes only. I'm gonna put a bit of tape on the top of my arm there, top of my forearm. Right, okay, so. What you're looking for, especially if you're wanting to draw the ball, hit the ball more naturally from the inside without thinking about it too much. If you have your elbow pointing out too much, that's going to really encourage you to swing left after the ball. Vice versa, if you twist your arm, so you can see now from this kind of uh, elbow pointing out, and I'm going to twist it, you can now see it's really going to encourage i can see obviously you can't feel this but i can feel kind of my shoulder naturally in the way and then on the way down because remember if you've got this elbow pointing out so you can see the tape is more target side it's going to do the same coming down it's going to encourage you to be open and left vice versa if the tape i'll just squeeze it down if the tape is pointing more back behind the target and I keep that elbow and I keep that arm looking that way, it's really gonna help me swing from the inside. So at impact, you're looking for your left arm to be a bit more dominant. Obviously it's exaggerated a bit. So you can see from the behind view, my left arm is much more in the way and my right elbow is under. That's the kind of impact position you're looking for. But if your left arm is twisted that way, that's virtually impossible to get under unless you're really going to contort your shoulders, which is unnatural and you're probably not going to do it, especially if you're an over the topper. Right, so let's give a few a go. So what we always say is take a few little small practice swings to start with. Right, so let's hit a few. Nice. Well, actually, let's do a few practice swings, like I said. So let's really keep this tape in. It's a bit sweaty today, so <laughs> it's not easy to stay on. Okay, so we're really going to feel like this elbow is now pointing back behind us instead of that way. Right, let's keep it that way. Nice and smooth. So I shouldn't have an in, an out to win path. Woo, that was a thinny one. Okay, I should really draw a line, shouldn't I, on my, uh, on my uh, arm more than the tape. But anyway, you get the idea, you get the gist. So my elbow now is fully twisted internal not external one more let's keep it going nice easy swing thought today to take onto the golf course let's twist our left arm you slices of the ball okay before this falls off let me just do one more so let's twist our left arm as much as we can lock it in there it doesn't have to be tight my grip's still light well it's gone so let's do one without so you can see now, if I'm keeping that left arm internal, it's allowing this club to drop down a little bit more. Right, one more. And that's really going to stop the club going left through impact. And I love those little quick little fixes we can take on the golf course straight away that hopefully will help us and stop us from fishing on the outside there a little bit. So give that a go next time. Let me know if it works. Remember, I love little causes and effects. So if you can keep that arm in the, in the position where it's dominating the right, the club's got more chance to swing from the inside. Let me know. Thank you very much for joining me and I'll see you on the next one. Let's hope it's sunny like this one. Okay, cheerio.